exactly what what was I saying about the elite? Yeah, the splatter scope, I mean the splat charger, excuse me, and the elitor is basically the same in terms of damage, like when you do half charges. Um, up to like the nearly the max, it does like up to 80. And then when you're actually at the max, it doubles to do, I mean, it doesn't double, it just like sets it to something fixed. So here in this case, it's 180 and the splat charger is like, it's like 160. But like basically the, the half measures are still the same. So like this is 160 for the full and um, you can see it can go again up to 80. So it doesn't really change. Um, and yeah, like I used to be kind of like panicked when somebody would come close to me. But now I just know like you can just double tap people. I mean, okay, if you just do uncharged shots, it's like one, two, three. Okay, it does it does forty for each shot, right? But if you if you if you spend some time and try to look at the damage, it's like uncharge it's forty, right? If I charge it one quarter, it's like hold up. It's like fifty, right? If I charge it uh, a half half charge, it's like sixty. If I charge it uh, even more it's like 70 and then you can go up to 80 but obviously not quite up to 80 because like if you're at the max it does uh, I mean it does the set damage so like you have these values and then if you do some math you need a hundred to kill someone right so it's like I want to kill someone if I do 40 40 40 it's like a three shot so what I would want to do if I have a, a one tap right I need 60 now 60 is a half charge so, I mean, if you, if you manage to do a little bit more than a half charge and then one tap, bam, he's dead. Or if you do, what you could do is like 50 and 50. So you just need more than a quarter each time. So bam, bam, he's dead, right? This is easy. It's kind of like the bamboozler, if you think about it. Like, um, the bamboozler, it has... Okay, so the bamboozler's trick is that it charges to max very quick. And it has full range, but it's still... You know, you can like kind of strafe with it while, while you're charged, uh, which is cool. Uh, thing with the um, with the e-reader and, and the splatter scope is that once you're charged, you're really slow. But also, if you only like do half charges to do like some some close range fighting, right? You still strafe pretty fast, right? So this is kind of like the bamboozer. Uh, same thing that you can like do the double tap if you if it's it's not as practical as the as the bamboozler because like the bamboozler it charges to max so there's no there's no risk of doing less than a half than a quarter and then a half and so like for example you want to do uh 50 and 50 and you do whoop and then oh my bad i i failed so like instead of being a double tap it's a triple tap and now i'm dead because he killed me because uh, they messed up so like there's less risk of messing up with the bamboozler right but this still works and it's still pretty fast just like the bamboozer and well um sure you can't like just keep your charge and and still move fast you know you gotta you gotta pace yourself and also it has less range than a bamboozer um for like the damage it does right it's like hold up uh doop 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 clean up so like if you wanna how much damage does the bamboozer do actually? I think it does like 85. Okay, so 85. You're clearly not gonna get that much damage with the half charges, right? But if you think about it, it's still a double tap, right? Like, yes, the bamboozer can kill while people are running. Like, you're comparing the full kits of, of the bamboozer against the ha the half charge which is not intended on the on the e-leader. So it doesn't make sense. Like, sure, this one can kill if the enemy stepped in ink. But that's because that's the main mechanic of the of the weapon. And also one of its main mechanic is that it cannot one-shot. Whereas the E-Leader can easily and it has the most range. So like, yeah. Uh, so, the, so the point, okay. E-Leader is long range. But if somebody come, comes close to you, you, you don't have to be panicked. You can still like kill people pretty easily. So yeah, yeah sure. You, can, you don't have as much range with the half charges. But you can still tap strafe, right? And and you just need a little bit more awareness of the timing and stuff, but it's easy, easy. Right? It's so like you have two options, either quarter charges and then you kill. 
or you do a 60, 60 damage, half charge, uh, and then you just do one tap, which is which is pretty great. Like if you if you aim well your first shot, like you d you don't have time, the person is coming close to you, so like you just do a half charge, and then you can just spam until you just hit them with a straight shot and they die, right? Uh, and if you wanna know if you did the um, the half charge or not, uh, you can actually fill it in the vibration. Um, so like if you just do like any charge before the halfway point, it doesn't have any vibration. Uh, but if you if you go past the halfway mark, it has a very strong vibration on the e beater, and it also has one on the on the splatter scope, but it's less strong. Uh, it's harder to notice. So if you want to practice, I would definitely recommend trying out the E-Leader. I mean, okay, sure, not a lot of people are going to have the E-Leader unlocked. And probably if you have the E-Leader unlocked, then you're probably good with it. But ma okay, maybe maybe you don't know this trick, so it's still fair to explain. Um, but yeah, if, if you do have the E-Leader, it's, it's easier to feel the vibration. If you felt the vibration, then you can just spam until you hit a straight shot. If you didn't hear the vibration, that means you barely missed the mark. So just on your next shot, just charge it a little bit, uh, a little bit more than just a stray shot, and that way you do a 50/50 instead of a 60/40, right? It's like charge, whoop, I missed. Then I charge a bit and bam, double shot. And whoop, oh, I felt the vibration. I can just spam until I hit it. Uh, so that's that's it. That's my sniper tips. Hopefully that helps.